Welcome to the Running Network Show. Join us each time as we explore the people, the places, and the events that shape our great sport. But I mean, is that is that the good thing? That is, as great as today was, you know, uh, making the team PR and stuff. That I mean, obviously, you, you'll go back with your coaches and, and realize that there's you know uh, some some technical things that you can improve upon uh, because obviously you know it's going to take uh, 53 to, to be in that mix in the final. Right. Absolutely. Uh, there's always room for improvement. So uh, my coach and I will sit down and figure it out. But I'm very optimistic about work. Okay. Uh, obviously, I know you're focused on on, on Cassandra, but uh, but can you just kind of uh, speak to the, uh, uh, you know, uh, to, the to the rise? I mean, Shamir was competing at the junior national finals last year, you know, and, now, and obviously you know, she's your teammate, you know, ready to compete in a world championship. I mean, all respect, like you said, for Georgiana and Lashinda for what they've already accomplished. But, I mean, it seems like you, you and her are at a time when, you know, when her star is rising. Right. Uh, she's, she's a trooper. She's handled these rounds like a veteran. And uh, the thing that she's done two times NCAA tap champion, I only won one. She won back to back and she's so young. I mean, she's so talented. And she has so many years left ahead of her. Yes, I heard the crowd and I heard a, a bang, but it wasn't by me, so I didn't really know what was going on. I just tried to keep focused on my hurdles. I didn't want to be involved in any of it. Is it hard to stay focused in that moment when you when you can hear those other things happening? Um, it's easy to get distracted, but you know you have to stay focused on your landing and ready to hit. Thank you. Sandra, best of luck. Thanks so much. Thank you. Good luck. Thank you.